Hey everyone, today we're diving into diesel exhaust fluid or DEF and how it's made. Let's break it down. What is DEF? DEF is a solution used in diesel engines to reduce harmful emissions. It's made up of 32.5% high purity urea and 67.5% deionized water. When DEF is injected into the exhaust stream of a diesel engine, it helps convert harmful nitrogen oxides or NOx into harmless nitrogen and water. How is DEF made? 1. Urea production, synthesis. Urea is created from ammonia, NH3, and carbon dioxide, CO2. Under high pressure and temperature, these chemicals react to form ammonium carbamate, which is then dehydrated to produce urea. 2 NH3 plus CO2 yields NH2 Kun4, which then becomes NH2 2CO plus H2O. Solidification. The urea is cooled and turned into solid prills or granules. Mixing with water. The solid urea is dissolved in deionized water to create a solution with exactly 32.5% urea. High quality water is used to prevent impurities. Filtration and quality control. The DF solution is filtered to remove any impurities, ensuring it meets the strict ISO 22241 standard. Packaging and distribution. The final DEF product is packaged in containers of various sizes, from small bottles to large bulk shipments, and then sent out to retailers and service stations. Where do the chemicals come from? Ammonia or NH3? Ammonia is made using the Haber-Bosch process, which takes nitrogen from the air and hydrogen from natural gas to create ammonia. Major ammonia production happens in regions rich in natural gas, like the Middle East, Russia, and the USA, Carbon dioxide, or CO2, CO2 used in urea production often comes from other industrial processes, such as natural gas processing and fermentation in the beverage industry. By capturing and using CO2, we help reduce greenhouse gas emissions. Key points. The Haber-Bosch process converts nitrogen and hydrogen into ammonia. Carbon capture CO2 is sourced as a byproduct from various industries. ISO 22241 standard ensures DEF purity and quality. That's a quick look at DEF and how it's made. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more. See you next time.